Salamu alaikum! Yes. Today we are making baklava. Shalom. So, welcome to Abu Anomaly's kitchen where today we are handcrafting baklava, papa. I was in Paris with my friends recently and we went to a very nice little Lebanese restaurant. Lebanese nuts. And then for, for dessert they had baklava. And my dear friend Furious, he actually brought with him some baklava from Turkey. I tried it in my hotel room and goddamn it was 10 out of 10. So, today we're gonna make it ourselves. Yeah. Even though we're not Turkish, but I'm from Sweden and let's be honest, it's about 10% Turks living there. So, we're gonna enjoy this quite a lot. Oh! Oh! Nah. <laughs> so, Papa, all you need are some nuts. We have pine nuts and we also have walnuts. I think for this one, we're gonna opt for the pine nuts, the more traditional Turkish baklava. In here, we also have some of the dough, which is needed, some filo dough, which is very nice over here, Papa, you can see. Yeah. Wow. And in case we fail, we have some test baklava here. This is like the test subject. We're gonna see if we can make it better than this, basically. Yeah, I think we can. To get started, Papa, we are going to clarify some butter. There we go, Baba. I have the butter here. We are going to be melting that one, which is very nice. Yeah. There we go, we put it in there, and now it's melted, because we've already actually melted it. Because you don't only need to melt the butter, you need to melt it and remove the milk protein, so you're left with clarified butter. Whoa, Papa. I could drink this shit. Mm, that's what I say when I have diarrhea. Now, we're gonna have a pan like this one. We're gonna dip our pencil in it. In it. Oi! <laughs> and then look here, look here, Baba. There we go. We are spreading the butter and then the dough. You have to be very careful. This dough is ultra thin. Mamma mia! This doesn't sound like something a bread. Haha! -ha! We have more dough, Baba. That one was kind of dry and sad. This is so thin, so incredibly thin. Like my will to live. Look, look at that. Can you see me? Now we're gonna put this one here. Look, look, look. Yeet. And then we're gonna match it up just about around like this. We're gonna put it, come here, come closer, come closer. Look, look, look. We're gonna match it. Oh, wait, so that it's like in every single corner, like so. We're gonna flatten it a little bit. There we go. That's layer one. Now, this is very uh, p -p peculiar because we need to do it many times. You maybe think one layer dough, and then you put the butter bread, then you have a sandwich. No, because this is so thin, we need to do this many times. So we take some more butter in here. Come look, come look. Yeah. Like so. And now, guess what, Baba? Another layer of dough. So many layer of this fucker, Papa. Fucker, I barely know her. In the corner, in the corner, like a football player offside. I don't know what that is, but it, they are in the corners. <laughs> there we go, another one. And then we do it all again. Whoever invented baklava must have been really, really bored. He's like, what, what do I spend my whole day doing? Putting dough in a tray 25 times? Yes, that's a good weekend. Salamu alaikum. There we go. Put the baklava to bed. That's crazy. This really fits me because you know my whole thing is wearing a baklava. So I really like making it finally myself. Nay, I forgot the butter. There we go. Huh. There we go. You're getting the hang of it, yeah? Yes. How many layers have we done? Like four? Holy shit, this is gonna take so long. You're supposed to do like fucking 11 or 14 or something. <laughs> I think maybe let's do pistachio and then some more layers, okay? Yes. So, pistachios, you need to grind them up. Now, as you know, I am an avid user of grinder, so there's no problem for me. So you take the pistachios and you put them into the grinder. Okay. How do you do? You have to... Oh! <laughs> I'm fine, how do you? Hello. Yeah, hello. And then you put them into the grinder. Now, how do you... Nay. Hey, no, this one. Yes. How the fuck do you... Yes. Oh! And how do you put button? Perfect. No. It's supposed to have a lot of bits. It doesn't anymore. <laughs> Furious, I am very sorry. It's supposed to have lots of bits in it, but Linda's fucking yeah. hooker fucking blender yeah. is set on max max always. You see, this is a nice piece of it. Mm -hmm. And then just... Linda, <laughs> fuck the mixer. Okay, now you put some butter on it. Oh yes, you do like this. I saw it online. You do like a... Uh, 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 
<laughs> then you take more of this hooker dough and you poke it down. People call you a content creator, you know? Mm -hmm. Where's the content? <laughs> Just kidding. If I remember correctly, the ones that Furious brought me didn't really look like this. <laughs> Maybe they didn't do it right. Yes, that's true. What do the Turks know about baklava? This is like a going through the library of Alexandria. Just <laughs> so many old scrolls and you have to be ultra careful or they break. Linda, we don't butter. <laughs> we need more butter. <laughs> Furious, I hope I get like a respect Turkish passport after this because I am trying hard Which isn't what I'm doing. I'm giving it a decent effort, but I have an erection So I am trying hard now more of this look here. Are you ready? I think this cooking fits you because you also have many layers I, but <laughs> You see through the layers this looks very good now one more Philo There we go we're running out of filo, but it's perfect by me because I counted every layer, so I know it's gonna be mm, the last layer. We put it down, we put it down into the corners. It looks like napkins. <laughs> it does look like someone shat in a diaper. There we go. Now, do you wanna see life hack? Yeah. Inside here, you just cut. Wait, first of all, we can do like this. Look, 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 look. All the layers, gone. Look, all the layers, gone. This is a life hack how you make it. Look, it's like a fucking corn on the cob. You just peel off the layers and then you can eat it. Yes. Oi, fuck. Yeah, just stab it and yeah. it will be all good. <laughs> Furious is really crying. Nah, it's not that bad actually. I think next time we're gonna do lasagna. <laughs> it actually isn't even that bad. Yes. Now I saw online what they do. They take a big knife and they cut it. They say, uh, you, you cut it like zigzag. There we go. This is fucking actually good. I think this is gonna be good, the best baklava I've ever had. I'm just sad that Furious isn't here to try it because I know he would love it. I think that this last piece might be a little dry. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you have to cut like this as well. Otherwise it's very big pieces. There. <laughs> now what you do is you pour butter on top of it. Even more? Yeah, why is there's a black piece in here? Why is it black? There we go. Now I think it goes into the oven for 30 minutes. So we're gonna put this one into the oven. It's looking pretty good actually. There we go. Now we have to wait. So we'll be right back. Hey, 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 hey. So Papa, now it's almost done. We just got some water and cinnamon in here. Here we have the sugar. We're gonna pour it in here. Very nice, like so. There we go. And we're gonna have some lemon in it as well. There we go. And now we're gonna turn it off and let that combine, Papa. While this is doing its thing, Papa, yeah. I I am going to be taking out the baklava off the oven. Let's see here. Oi, fuck. Okay. Looking good. That's not looking horrible, actually. There we go. Now, look, look at it, look at it. The sugar is dissolved, but it is not burned. We have a little bit of water and cinnamon in there. Now it's perfect. It's not turned into caramel. It's ready. Now, we, ah! Now we are going to, where's the knife? We're just gonna make the cuts again so that this sugar will penetrate deep into the baklava. Here, Papa. Look, look, look. Yeah. There we go. This is what I'm talking about, Papa. This is how you make a busting baklava. It does look a little rough, but I think it's gonna taste just fine. Yes. Let's wait for this bad boy to cool down, and then we're gonna sit down and have our taste test. Yeah. Okay, Papa. Now the baklava has cooled off, and you can see it's looking a little rough. Not gonna lie, the baklava that Furious bought me looked a little more appetizing than this. But don't worry, because we have the, the baklava powder here. We're gonna spread a little bit on top. There we go. Now, Papa, we are ready. Are you ready? Yes. Look at this piece. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> it kinda looks like baklava. Now that does look like baklava now. Chip. Alhamdulillah, Papa. Yes? This is shit. 
It's so wet. It tastes a lot like butter, but it's not bad. Fully. <laughs> ah! I mean, if you like butter... Ah! Huh? Let's compare it, Baba. Yes? To the regular store-bought, store probably not homemade, mass-produced baklava. Let's see here. Difference? I mean, color-wise a little bit, but I'm not racist, so no. this is fine. Only one layer of pistachio. We have two, Baba. Yeah. So that's already a perk. Mass-produced baklava going in hot. Also a little moist, much more sugar, much, much sweeter. Okay. Papa, yes? I want you to try. And you decide which one you like. Do I have to? Yes. <laughs> okay. Give me the camera. Okay, Papa. Yes. Now it's your time to try the baklavas and see which one you like, okay? Your piece is looking a little better. Oh, mighty fine baklava, actually. Not even horrid, okay? Take a big piece. Homemade bak <laughs> <laughs> baklava. Oh, it looks pretty good. Do you think? Yeah, I like buttery things. Oh, oh my g papa, that is a very good evaluation. Yeah, could I have my money now? <laughs> no, you try this one now, try this one. What would you score our baklava? And you can't say seven. What would you score it? Eight. Eight, what? Eight, that means it's good, that means it's good. Okay, this is the store-bought baklava. Uh, really? Honestly? Mm-hmm, it's too sweet. What would you give the store-bought baklava? One to ten, you can't say seven. Five. Oh, hey, that is a pretty good rating. No, not a pretty good cake. Cake? It's not a cake. What the fuck is it? It's a cake. Abomination. <laughs> Linda, this is ours. Try it with your big horse tooth. Mm. Oh, it's dripping. Why is it so fucking wet? Yeah, that's what I tell the bitches. It's too much butter. Yeah, how many points? You can't say seven. Four. Yeah, Linda probably likes that because it's just a sugar cube, but that's what you feed the, the horses. <laughs> <laughs> Try it. How many? Five. Five? Okay, so she doesn't like baklava. Fucking white woman, Papa. Yeah. So, what do you think, Papa? I think this was a success, even though it tasted probably too much little butter. But I am going to be mailing this one in a package to Furious. Yeah. So he can see what a good baklava tastes like. And he could uh, offer his whole tribe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> his tribe. Okay, Papa. That was a very good experiment, Papa. High five. Baklava completed. Eight points. Yes. So Furious, you better finish all of it. Yes. And share. Mm, best tribe member. 